Hey guys, Sword here, and based on the title, you saw that I titled this Do the Harlem Shake. Well, if you thought that was going to actually do it, look at the time. It's about 11 minute video, so there's no way I'm going to be doing the Harlem Shake for that long. So I am sorry if I disappointed any of you, any of you thinking that I was actually going to do the Harlem Shake. Maybe I will do it, maybe I won't, but this is going to be the video where we discuss about it. And since I just want to have some visuals going on in the background rather than having a black screen, I wanted to do a little bit of Minecraft working on Operation Bedrock. But for now, we're going to talk about the Harlem Shake because apparently that is the viral or the most trending thing that's going on to YouTube since February 2nd. And for those who do not know what the Harlem Shake is, well, it originally started off, well, just you could just go to old school, the new school, but we're going to go to the new school thing where a person made made or by the name of Bauer created a track called the Harlem Shake and it's been going around for quite a while it's been uploaded nine months ago I'm not too sure if that was the original artist but apparently that's the only video I could actually find so it was nine months ago Harlem Shake HQ by Bauer sorry if I pronounced the name wrong but that's what I see whenever I saw that name so I'm gonna say Bauer so Bauer created this song and then a good up to the point of February 2nd, Disaster Music actually made somewhat of a parody of it, taking 30 seconds of the first part of the song and just started dancing with it. And that was the first one ever to make a parody of it. And then the same day, another person or a group of people actually did the parody. Probably on, I don't know. It's just, it was just one of these things that was spontaneously spontaneously just brought out. I don't even think that this awesome music actually meant for this to happen, but a lot of people actually started doing this trend. And a lot of people started doing dancing, and a lot of people just kept going with it. And a lot more and more people just kept on going with it. And it's been at least, well, it's been 10 days, and there's already hundreds of videos of people of doing the Harlem Shake. So over a hundred responses, maybe even thousands of responses, who knows? There's a bunch of videos of people doing the Harlem Shake. So it's one of those things that's gone viral and as well as that I would call it like plaguing them on YouTube because a lot of people are doing it. Famous people are doing it and other people are doing it. It's just, it's everywhere. Search up Harlem Shake and you will see a lot of videos and every single one of those videos have over thousands and thousands and thousands of views. A lot of them have millions of views so it's a it's a viral trend I have never seen anything like this before and it just reminds me of Gundam style because everyone knows Gundam style was one of the most recent trends that was pretty much going around YouTube that one started about at July and then after six months it's gone over a billion views so a lot of people were, saw Gundam style, they saw the video, they found it entertaining, a lot of people were doing parodies of it, and a lot of those parodies are getting millions and millions of views. So now, it seems like the Harlem Shake is the brand new Gundam style, so a lot of people have actually commented that this is going to kill Gundam style, which Gundam style has really gone so far in the short course of the few or six months so you got to give them credit but now it's all about the Harlem Shake a lot of people are doing the Harlem Shake it, it actually caught me by surprise to see how many people were doing it I searched it up I got to at least five pages and there's a lot of names that I recognize and I have a few of the names there I apologize if I skipped anyone but these are the people that I looked at and I see that they actually made a a Harlem Shake video themselves. So we have IGN, we have Shake Carl, we have Mystery Guitar Man, SP Films, someone even filmed T Pain doing it. We have Spark Mac, Source Fed, College Humor, Five Second Films, Infinity Ward. Infinity Ward did it too. That caught me off the most surprisingly that they actually did this. Then we have Daystorm, Atlantic Videos, The Hazard Cinema, Champ Chong, we have Woody's Gamer Tag. Boogie 2988 and of course Disaster Music actually started it at all and I don't even think Disaster Music actually meant for this to be a trend they were just doing some stupid video let's be honest it was kind of a stupid video but now a lot of people are doing this stupid video so yeah a lot of people are doing this trend and I gotta say I'm not gonna lie it's just one way one good easy way to actually get a lot of viral video views because more people are seeing the viral Viralness or the viral, whatever you want to call it, 
they're seeing this video and they're, wor they're switching up every other video that's relating to this. And I'm not going to lie, if I actually get a lot of good views because of this, so be it. I wanted to be the one of those type of people that want to discuss about it. So I want to ask you, what do you think about the Harlem Shake? If you actually seen it, what do you guys think about it? Is it any good? Is it stupid? Is it funny? Is it fun? Or is it just one of those things that a lot of people are just having fun with because... It's kind of cool to see a lot of people actually participating in this and as well as that if you're a person who did this you're probably gonna get a good amount of views so that's actually a good boost for your channel if you're a person who loves to make videos and you just make videos for fun and joining this trend actually would help you get a, a boosted amount of views and then there's the other half of the people saying that this is entirely stupid and people who make these videos put no effort into it and they're getting a lot a lot of views while other people who are putting hard work into it or hard work into their own videos they're not getting as much views as the other people who put no effort to it well that may be true but if if this will actually help if a person who does a lot of hard work for their videos and then they start to do a little bit of trending or follow the trend of a lot of people then people will actually see their content and from there they probably may subscribe to them for their content that they put out but you have to have fun every now and then I'm actually thinking of doing the Harlem Shake I probably may either do it on this channel or maybe my RL channel because on my RL channel I don't really care for much of that anymore I just gotta have a lot of friends to actually help me out in acting stupid because there's little golden rules that there are because in a lot of these videos you're gonna have to follow them one rule, someone has to wear a mask or someone has to have something covering their face because in a lot of these videos, someone wears a mask or a helmet or something like that. And then number two, one person has to be at least half naked. I don't know why, there's a lot of videos of people either being half naked or dressing up in costumes. And then of course, there's three and four where there's going to be either wall humping or chair humping. A lot of people do that too. Apparently, the more crazy the video is, the more viral it gets or the more funny it gets. So you have to do something spontaneous in these videos. Maybe something not expected. I'm going to post the link of a few of these videos in the description, of course. So you could actually take a look at that for yourself. So you got to be spontaneous in these videos too. So you got to do something unexpected. There's one that I completely did not expect due to the fact that I watched so many of the other Harlem Shake videos that this one caught me off guard and I'm going to put that in parentheses, the best one. So you can check that out. Maybe you'll see that it is one of the most spontaneous or whatever the most random one you could actually see. So there you have it. So this is a video where we're going to discuss about the Harlem Shake and what do you guys think about it and maybe have some discussions here and there about it because this is one of the most viral trends that you probably would see on YouTube. And I want to see YouTube actually do something like they have a section dedicated to this because you, don't, you guys know that YouTube does sections dedicated for some things every now and then. So I want to see them dedicate this to the Harlem Shake and I want to see Bauer himself talk about this entire trend and this entire fad that everybody's actually doing because you gotta give you gotta give the original artist credit even though he's probably gonna make more money off of this videos because in every video you see advertisements and royalties go to the artist and then you see the little link saying that you can buy this music off of MP, Amazon MP3, iTunes, eMusic, Google Play so yeah more people are gonna probably download the music and he's gonna get a lot more money but I want to see his initial reaction to this and as well as that I want to see YouTube actually doing a little section for it so maybe we could actually vote for the best one and this is where I ask you who do you think actually has the best Harlem Shake video version ever because there's gonna be hundreds and hundreds of them but someone wants to point out the best because in every video that I see there's always that top comment saying that I think this is the best so if YouTube actually does something about this where we're gonna to have to vote for it then we'll see who is the best based upon how many votes it actually gets so I want to see that actually be a small competition and I'm not too sure when will this trend die out because it seems that for every day there's about a hundred more videos about it and there's compilations or compilations however you want to pronounce it I don't know how to pronounce it really it's just that there's a lot of videos out there people combining these videos saying what this is the best this is the best or how many of these types of versions there are I've seen a firefighter version I've seen one person do it by themselves I see a lot of people just having fun with it and like I said maybe I'll actually do it either on this channel or my RL channel and I'm gonna have to get a group of my friends to help me out on this one because I'm not gonna do it alone I don't care if I act stupid in front of the camera as long as I have my friends to help me out in that part then I'll do it too so 
There we go. Harlem Shake is one of the most viral success I have ever seen on YouTube, and anyone who actually does the video about it will actually get a substantial amount of views. If I do get a substantial amount of views, so be it. If not, I just want to talk about it because someone has to talk about it. I'm pretty sure a lot of people want to talk about it, but there's no discussion video out there about it, really. It's just everyone else is just making a dance video about it, which is understandable because you got you to gotta do what you got to do. And there you go. So there's nothing really else for me to say. It's just I want to see how long will it take for Harlem Shake to actually just die down. And then you just see maybe one to three videos a day rather than seeing hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of videos a day on this trend. I've never seen anything like this, honestly. It just reminds me of Gondam Style. Just when everyone actually saw it, everyone made their own parody, and then Psy got a lot, a lot of attention for that. Of course, being the number one YouTube video in the world now. So, yeah. It's just gonna see how interesting this thing has come, come by. It's only been 10 days, and already you see hundreds and hundreds of video versions. So, there you have it. That's all there is for me to say. I have honestly nothing else for me to say right now so of course in the last 20 seconds you're gonna see that on the top right corner that's gonna be a video annotation to my other video if you want to play with all the minecrafters so with nothing else for me to say right now I am sort of Kings of Zero. have a nice day everybody I will see you next video